Hello everybody, welcome back to another day on the road to 20. Today it is the 3rd of June and tomorrow I'm going to run a pretty exciting competition. The meet is called the Bislet Night of Highlights and it's late tomorrow and I am going to run the 200 meter. Two weeks ago I opened my season with 21.19 into a minus 1.4 headwind. I was running all by myself and last weekend I ran 10.50 uh, in the 100 meter. So I think there is a good chance for a personal best tomorrow. I am hoping the competition will be good and I will run as fast as I can. So right now I am on my way out to do a little bit of a preparation session before tomorrow. And while I'm on my way there, you can have a little bit of a look on the session I had a couple of days ago. some light drills and then some light technical runs on the spikes before I did a couple of hurdle jumps. Feeling pretty good so my next session will be a small little warm-up tomorrow about four hours before the meet tomorrow and uh, yeah looking forward to race tomorrow.
Mathias, Mathias Åve Johansen. Ti løp under 21-17, men med den irriterende persen 21 blank. Var på tredje beste tiden gjennom tiden i Norge i 2017, da han løp det. Siden har vært mye skader. Så vi tok opp mot hverandre, så også opp på vannet i bane 3. År av bakketun, som har vært tredje beste tiden i Norge på 400 noensinne. Håve Johansen og Kvar på ganske likt ut av sviggen her. Nå Håve Johansen har faktisk en meter eller to. Da står han selv opp og feier ifra. Mathias Håve Johansen feier ifra. Får vi se hva han sier klokka denne gangen. I've just been sitting here, letting this sink in. I think you can imagine I'm feeling pretty good. And uh, yeah, I've been writing an Instagram post. Um, I started writing a little bit about this journey and it got a bit longer than I expected. So I used quite a while to write that. And uh, yeah, now I'm packing my bags because uh, I might be running another 200 tomorrow or in the, or today. Uh, so now I will sleep for a little bit and uh, then I'll take the train to Lillehammer. If my legs are not too horrible after this 2098 and uh, like four hours of sleep. Um, I think I can go even faster. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. I only got about three hours of sleep that night and I woke up feeling a little bit weird. Not yet sure if I should run, I headed on the bus to Lillehammer. Okay, I just arrived here in Lillehammer and I'm feeling a little bit tired. There are 200 meters here and then a 200. I think maybe I'll warm up for the 100 and just run an easy one in the first one and to see how I feel. I had an easy 10.7 in the heats, so I decided to run the final. My rhythm was a little bit weird in the 100, but I ran a 10.51, so I decided to run the 200. So, two great competitions, two days in a row, and that finally concludes my five years on the road from 21 to 20 seconds in the 200 meter. And then, this is the final road to 20 vlog, so I guess that means no more vlogs from here on out. Peace. Just kidding, of course. As always, this video is a little bit late, and I already have filmed several videos coming for you guys from this 2021 season. I have already posted the name of the next series for the channel members. And here is a little bit of a shout out for you guys who decided to join the channel and to decided to support me a little bit extra on this journey. Thank you very much. It's been a long road, and I never expected to make more than 70 vlogs documenting it. 
and I absolutely never expected more than 25,000 people to subscribe to my channel and follow me on this journey. I think I'll keep making these from time to time as long as at least like a thousand or no, 20 people watch them. Hope you guys have enjoyed being on this road to 20 with me and I hope you will continue to follow me on the way to new goals. Of course, I'm very happy about finally breaking 21 seconds after it being my main goal for almost five years. But like everything else in life, that satisfaction is only temporary and I do not have a passion for bragging about good personal bests. I have a passion for improvement and uh, already I have set myself new goals and I have big goals for the next season which I will tell you more about in my next video. Um, I'm really excited about the next year coming. Um, I hope you guys are excited too. So the road continues with new goals and new challenges and I'm looking forward to sharing that with you guys. And even though this is my final Road to 20 episode, I do think I will have to make a bigger video recapping my whole journey from 23 seconds to 20 seconds. So thank you so much for watching guys. Thank you for all the support and the kind words along the way. An extra thanks to my channel members. And I'll catch you guys somewhere else on the road to new personal bests. Peace. Hey guys, it's been a while. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's a new year and time for a new vlog. I think I'm going to call this vlog Road to 20 as we're in 2019 on our way to 2020 and I really want to run 200 meters in 20 something seconds this year.